Hey guys, today we're going to be talking about the different contributors to NASCAR championship season. Uh, so let's get into the video. First up is sponsors. Arguably one of the most important parts of the NASCAR, you know, championship. Basically, these are the people that give you money to develop your car and research things to make your car better and pay better things. Like, they basically pay you so that you can perform better. And in return, like, you run around the racetrack with their name on your car. And it's uh, actually a pretty decently efficient way of getting your name out there. It's pretty expensive, though. But sponsors are the most important part to getting a, Na a NASCAR championship because of the money that you get. And you can use that money to research how to make your car more aerodynamic and faster on a racetrack. Now we go into pit crew. Basically what these guys do is make sure that the pit stops are fast and that you get refueled and all that stuff so that you can finish the race in a very good position and get your stage points or win points or whatever. This is really important to winning a championship because of the fact of if you don't have a fast pit stop, you're going to lose a lot of positions. And that's basically key to getting points is being up front in that pack and running up there pretty much all race. That's one of the key contributors to getting your points, which then get you into the NASCAR um, playoffs I guess they're called. And then eventually you can win the championship if you're fastest at that track at the end of the season. Okay, now let's get into the actual car itself. Having a fast car is basically key to gaining positions. Even if you're having a bad day pit-wise, if you have a good car and a fast car, then you have a good chance of getting a win. And on the other side of that is if you do have a bad car, then you're probably going to finish in the ladder, probably towards the back. It's I would probably go for a lot of speed, but I would mainly go for a driver, um comfort level in there because if the driver is comfortable inside their car then they will be able to perf uh, perform better because they'll be more comfortable and they're not like fidgeting around trying to get comfortable okay spotters that's a very important part to the equation they're basically telling you where every other car on there is if you're clear to make a pass um if you clear up high or low they're basically doing the grunt work of telling the driver what he would need to do to basically get around the track and get a win. Because if you're like a Jeff Gordon kind of guy and you're starting dead last and you work your way up to the first, you're going to need to know where like 40 or in the older days, 43 different cars are. Basically, they tell you where those cars are and how you would need to pass them. Or if the car is coming up, hey, this guy's coming up and you're right, you might want to do a block or something like that. Um, that's pretty much all there is for spotter. Now, certainly, n but uh, certainly not least. He's last but certainly not least is the driver. If you have a talented driver making their weaving in between wrecks and that stuff and getting up front, you have a good chance of winning. The drivers are one of the more important parts but not the most important part. Um, the driver, he's actually in there making sure that that good car you have because of all the spotters. Um, and all of the sponsors that are giving you money, that good car is not going to waste. He's the one making sure that the pit crew gets a win, and the pit crew is making sure that he will get a win by making those fast stops. Basically, all these stuff, 
all this stuff has to come together perfectly to win multiple championships like let's say uh, Jeff Gordon or Jimmy Johnson have done. All that stuff has to come together perfectly to win it multiple times. You may get lucky and win it once or twice, but to win it like three or four or like eight times, that's hard to do. Um, so uh, thank you guys for watching. See you next time.